The teams are ready, and so are we. Sagan's the starting center for the Stars. Henrik Sedin's there for Vancouver. Here at Special Effects, we are often looking for games that don't require too many inputs. Today, we will be looking at NHL 17 using the NHL 94 control mode. Here we are playing offline, but it's also possible to play online using this control mode. got the lead in this game on the road early in the contest. Let's have a look at the NHL 94 controls. The offensive controls include left analog stick for movement, square for sprint or hustle, X for pass and circle for shoot. The defensive controls use square for sprint, X for change player and circle for body check or tackle. When controlling the goalie or fighting there are more controls but it is possible to play without using all of the inputs and you can also set the goalie to be controlled automatically. NHL 17 is a fast paced game and if you're finding there is a lot going on on screen and want to be able to play matches it might be an idea to try playing as the goalie. If controlling the whole team is difficult, be a pro mode allows you to play as one player for a whole match. When playing offensively without the puck, X will now call your teammates to pass the puck to you. Double tapping triangle in some situations will allow you to start a fight in game. What is he thinking? That's certainly gonna draw a crowd. When fighting in game, you can try playing using just one stick and buttons or using both sticks. Here we will try both control schemes. If you watch the controller on the bottom right hand side of the screen, you will see us changing controls part way through. If someone else has started the fight, you will need to press triangle to accept. Let's have a look at trying to fight with the sticks. And yet another fight has begun and ended. The fans are loving it, even the peanut vendors are loving it. Practice Arena allows you to play one on one against the goalie, which is great for practice but also a slower paced way to play the game. There is also a mode where you can practice being the goalie against a team of players. Shootout mode allows you to practice shots in a more competitive way. When the opponents are taking shots the game is automatically set up for the goalie to be controlled for you but you can also select to control the goalie manually if you prefer. Thank you for watching, and if you know of any other games that don't require too many inputs, then please comment below to let us know.